at the bottom. Let's see, is there any way for me to get in? Yeah, there is. I wonder. Yep, I got a feeling I had to fly. So let's keep flying. Okay, what the hell did I get? A new devil power, huh? What is it this time? It is Flame Heart. Ooh, nice. A magical storm with fierce fire. Ooh. Me likey. So let's see how this works when I get my butt down. Now, I'm assuming this this thing does like f massive fire damage. That might come in handy. Depends what I'm fighting. But in any who, I'm assuming we're taking this door. Now, oh, it's just you lot, huh? Well, you're no threat. I could just chop you up for days. <laughs> Bats. Now, you, I do want to kill. Heh <laughs> heh. Wipe out all those bloody bats. Gotcha. You think you were gonna escape from me, you flying freak? Not a chance. Ooh. A time thing. That could come in handy later. Oh. You're immune to fire. I am not. Is he healing because of that fire? Yeah, that's cheating. There he is. Right. Whew. That was lucky. Now, where the hell am I? What's this? Ooh, Vendetta. A decorous sword that is like a death scythe. Ooh. Wait. Is that a corpse? Now somebody tells me I need that, and pardon my phone, that was my phone, um, going off. I'll have to check that later, that message later. But now's not the time. Right, jump over. Now that sword must have a reason. Can I use it? Oh, I can. Why not? Give it a good whirl. Let's see what this thing does. I thought it was just a, a decorative tool, but I guess not. Hmm. Not as fast as Rebellion, but it has a wider arc of attack. <coughs> Whoa! Ho, ho. My furry freaks coming at her. Well, come on then. Let's we die. Do you know what this scene reminds you of, guys? This reminds you of, um... Metal Gear. Yeah, remember Metal Gear? You know the whole elevator thing where you're going up and down and you know you get jumped? That's what this reminds me of. Ah, that was never bat. Now, yeah, but it looks like this sword has a like wider buff of attack. So that could come in handy. Ah, uh, blood goats, huh? Alright. Mind if I am um, crash your party? Go wait till this thing sh shuts down, then I can attack. <laughs> this thing's got good reach. Another one, huh? Bugger off. Come on, come on, you horn face freak. You can't hit me, can you? Oh, you got me, huh? That's all of them. Hmm. Nothing here. Let's check this way. Nothing. 
Let's have a look at down here. Nothing. So it seems like we gotta go through the train. Okay, okay. Hmm. Factory to the oil field, sir. So, we're gonna have a fight. Hmm. Some entertainment. I don't mind the entertainment. Ooh, nice. A lot of orbs for me to play with. And would the beeping please stop? You're making me hurt. Hurt my ears. Well, it's a good way of getting some orbs. So like I said, I need as many orbs as I can get. Now, I don't remember, guys, if the orbs transfer to the other character when you play the other one. So we are going to play the female after Dante. I know many of my female Dante should have been the last character because he is, you know, the main event. But I kind of feel that Dante in this game really doesn't do much. In my view, he doesn't. He just, um, he's just there, does a job, and just beats the crap out of people. Well, out of demons, so that's why he's only there. The other one, the lassie, she has more of a bit of a story to tell. So that's why I'm going with her as the, like, the main one after this. But in my personal opinion, I'll stand by this. I think Devil May Cry 2 is the weaker of the three. I mean, the strongest is Devil May Cry 3. That is the strongest. And we're stopping at the door field. Now, assuming the door back at the power plant, back at the factory, I think that is for um, her. Ooh, nice. More orbs. It's for a female protagonist. I think that's for her. Right, going up. Now, am I going to be attacked by those furry freaks? Forward, so. Oh, well, that's kind of cool. That doing that reverse um, bullet storm. Yeah. Like I wasn't gonna fall for that old trick. I was just screaming, trap. Right. And uh, let's see. Nice. Uh, which door do I go for? Not that one. Not that one. So it's this one. You gotta check everywhere. Hey, oh. Who are you? Okay, you scream, bad guy. And that was the end of the mission. And to be fair, guys, I didn't do anything. So that must have been the end. <coughs> Excuse me, well, guys. I'm gonna get a drink. And I do apologize for the trains in the background. There's nothing I can do. Like I've said, I live next to a railway line. There's not much I can do. Right, so we're off to mission nine. Sorry, mission eight. No, six I did before. Mission eight. The challenger shall rise while the king evades. Basically saying he's going to bugger off. 5,000. I could upgrade one of the swords, but... Yet again, I'm going to wait. Best time to upgrade them, guys, is probably near the boss end. Right. Let's see who the hell are you. Well, well, what have we here? Do you have to ask? Hmm. Well, aren't we smug? Whoa. Okay, are you a relative of Korn? You know, the blood god? Because you look like one of his uncles. Or his cousins, at least. And if you don't if you don't get that reference, then you're not a... For, then you don't know 40k at all. But yeah, he looks like, the, looks like the blood god. But anyway, back to fighting. Free helper, so he's a toughie. Wow. 
Wow, you hit like a truck. Nope, there's a help. What's he doing? Whoa, ring of fire, my ass. I think he's gonna throw that. Oh no, he's not. Oh, I get it. It's an inhaling attack. Um. You know, I do want that, you know. I don't want you. Good thing I got that. Right. <laughs> Eat that, you son of a bitch. Come on, a little more. Yikes, better get out. Just keep back, keep back, keep back, keep back, keep back, keep back, keep back. Yeah, get away, you filthy bull. Right. That's not more than that. <clears throat> I know there's one more out here, but I gotta avoid getting hit. Well, I've damaged him a little bit, and I think I've pissed him off. Oh, there was one more. I knew it. So, um, yeah, let's start kicking his ass. Yeah, I'm getting away from you, pal. Whoa. You can actually do that while I'm in there. Cheap. <laughs> nice try. You know, if you stop doing that attack, I could actually start punching the daylights out of you. <laughs> now. A little more, and I could just go full crazy. It's crazy time! Yeah, I may be taking damage, but it's but I'm also healing. Gotcha. <laughs> Heard this way, you're no way I'm bloodthirster. At least he gives me a challenge. What, do you not get turned to dust? Eh. Two minutes that took. Well, that was quick. Nineteen. Not bad. Not bad at all. Am I gonna get the situation I did with Demi Cry 1, which I, which I did it in a record time? Because I still don't know, guys, if it is or not. So, when I check it, I mean, I mean this will be a bit redundant because, like I said, I'm playing this back to back, so I don't know if I have or not. The hunter will discover the purity of speed. Ooh, speed, huh? Well, this should be interesting. All right. That was all the checks. Everything was okay. Right. If this is the essence of speed, oh, yeah, it. I get it. The building may explode at any moment. Oh, great. So I got 12 minutes to get the heck out, huh? Let's go. Yeah, not today, buddies. This is a game of speed. So, um, which way do I go? Check the map for a second. Okay, let's try the other way.
No, it's that way. No, it brings me back here. There's the corpse. Hmm. Right. Sorry, guys, but I'm not here to fight. I'm here to bugger off. Look, you guys can just blow yourselves up for all I care. All I care about is getting the hell out. What the hell? <laughs> Cheeky. I'm not gonna waste time, unfortunately. Much as I would love to get those red orbs, I'm not wasting time. This is a speed run. Whoa, crap. That was close. Am I at the top? Yep. There we go. Right. Get all the way to the door. Got it. It's time to hoof it. You bird brains again, huh? I don't have time to play. You guys can just muck about yourselves. I've got places to be, worlds to conquer. I don't have time. It seems to have only been when all lumps are lit. Ah, it's a land puzzle. Damn it. Alright. Play your game. I believe the third one is down here somewhere. Look, get lost, ya yeah. freaks. Just get out of my freaking way. There we go. Now, excuse me. I've got a jet. I wasted enough of my time with you, feathered freaks. Warning. Yeah, yeah, I heard you. I'm moving, I'm moving. Right, where to next? Uh, let's see. Um, That's where I gotta go, huh? Okay. Ugh, you lot, huh? Look, um, can we talk about this another day? Uh, let me take a rain check. Right, I think we're nearing the end, guys. Let me take a rain check, boys. Ah, that's what's going on, huh? So I've got to avoid the fight and just keep running. <laughs> Dodge all that. I'm assuming I've got to go back here, haven't I? Yep. What the hell? Damn it. Which way do I go? Let me have a look. Map. We're in the right area. 
But um, it would help if I knew where I was going. Uh, mind tell you what I gotta do? Unless. Uh, <laughs> I get it. I had to wait for the fan to get hit. Alright, alright. Let's see, do I go through here? Yep. <laughs> that was a little bit elaborate, but it paid off. And where the hell were you hiding that bike? Seriously, Dante, where the hell were you hiding that? Well, in any case, we've completed the mission. Del rank B. Wow, I'm well over 20,000. That's rare for me, I never get that high. Again, all I did was run, the, run like hell. But in anyhow, we're off to mission 10.